think I just got racism. <laughs> I was so mad, dude. I hate when people do this shit, dude. When I'm on, like, the same block as my work, it's, like, the last place I wanted to get into with some shit with. You know what I mean? Because, like, dude, they could, like, find you. It's, like, easier for... Like, if you're beefing with someone, they could find you. You like, could just walk in your liquor store. And it looked like some dude that would probably go in there. Really loud, obnoxious black dude. Obviously a junkie of some sort with mental issues. But, like, at first... Like, I just thought he was just being... I don't know, just fucking stupid, bro. I didn't know what he was really, like, trying to get at at first. He's like, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. Like, he's trying to be like uh, Speedy Gonzalez, but he didn't go, uh, what is this? Uh, Reba, Reba, you know what I'm saying? I forget what uh, Speedy Gonzalez does, but he was like, oh, no, oh, no. Like, and, like, dude, like, at first I didn't catch on. I was just mad because he yelled at me, you know what I mean? <laughs> And then he's like following this, this Hispanic girl. I don't know. She, she could have been Ecuadorian. So I don't want to call her Mexican. Because they'd get pissed. But um, he's following her yelling that shit. And then I noticed that the hat that he was wearing. It was like a fucking sombrero. So I'm like oh motherfucker dude. <laughs> I mean maybe he was just yelling at me just because. You know what I mean. So I can't really for sure say. But I mean dude you're following a Mexican or a Hispanic girl around. You know what I mean. Yelling that shit. I'm like 95% sure that's what he was trying to do, dude. So I was like, I'm not 100% sure, but, you know, seemed pretty racist, bro. So then, like, you know, I get away from the, the that block. And he goes to the library, and he's got some friends and shit, some crackhead motherfuckers over there. He does it again, bro. <laughs> uh, I had my knife on me, and I'm just like, dude... I do not want to stab anyone, dude, because I don't know what he's on. He's crazy. You know, I might have to stab someone. It's it's fucked up, but it's just the way it is out here. So I, like, had it in my pocket, and I, like, already fucking... I flipped it inside my pocket to get ready, you know, just in case. And I got my mace with me, too. But the thing with, the, like, the, the reason why I was going for the knife, though, is because there was other people there. I'm not trying to go mace a bunch of people, dude. <laughs> That's, like, that could be a real big problem. They could just turn on you. You know, you got beef with one. Now you got beef with fucking four or five motherfuckers. Fuck that. And I'm not really trying to do, you know, stab anyone either. But it's just like, dude, I don't know what the fuck this dude's doing. I would have went, like, aim for the shoulder blade or something to, like, just, you know, just combobulate him and shit. Take him out, dispatch his ass. Not kill him, though. I, I mean, I ain't trying to kill no one. Fuck that. I ain't trying to get no murder charge. This fucked up ass state that you know I'm just trying to defend myself, but in this fucked up state they probably stay out as the aggressor or some dumbass shit. You gotta be careful, bro. Go for non-vital areas, and even then you might hit a fucking artery, so you gotta be careful as fuck. I just, yeah, dude, I just get jumpy around people that are just crazy people in general, man. I had too much crazy shit go down. So it's just you gotta be on your fucking toes out here. But damn dude, he's ugly, ugly. Like, get the fuck out of here, dude. That shit pissed me off. <laughs> Just cause mainly because he was yelling at me, dude. And, and you know what really pissed me off even worse? Is he was sagging on a bike, bro. Like, dude, you are the lamest motherfucker alive. And he's like, he looks like someone, if he got off the bike, maybe he could have put up a good fight, maybe. But he looked like all crackhead and shit. But again, though, you gotta be careful. They get, like, extra fucking energy from the crack and shit. You don't know. I think that's just fireworks. But that shit had me jumping the fuck, bro. The fuck that shit, dude. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Pretty sure that was just some loud-ass firecrackers. But, man, fuck it. I don't give a fuck. Sometimes it's fucking 22s be sound like firecrackers, too. 25s and shit. <laughs> I'm not even in the hood. That's a sad, saddest part. I mean, it's a little ghetto over here, but it ain't the hood. God damn it. Fucking lame ass piece of shit fucking uh, microphone thing or headphone thing. Anyways, let me get the fuck out of here before I get shot. Or racism again.